now let's look at a down counter okay down counter is going to count down down means it's going to count like 76543210 okay and up counter counts up in increasing number of decimal numbers okay down counter again we are going to talk about a 3 bit counter over here you can anyways extend it to 4 bit 5 bit whatever you like so 3 bit is going to have a number of states equal to 2 raised to 3 which is 8 3 bit down counter okay states are 2 raised to 3 which is 8 let's see how it looks i have toggle flip flop okay when i'm talking about up or down counter i am talking about toggle flip flops okay you can anyways construct a toggle flip flop using jk okay so you have toggle you have q you have q bar you have toggle q and q bar toggle q and q bar okay so in a down counter what we do is we connect uh, before that let us draw the clocks okay in a down counter what happens is instead of doing like this that we did in up counter what we do is this we connect the complemented output to the clock okay the complemented output to the clock and over here you are going to have your initial clock okay again all the three inputs are tied together okay with what with logic 1 okay this is logic 1 so this is your 3 bit down counter okay this guy is what this is your q0 okay your q0 is this what is this this is your q1 and what is this this is your q2 the combination of q0 q1 and q2 forms one state okay let's look at what the wave form for this looks like okay so first of all i am going to draw the clock okay so here is my clock i'm going to take a look at at least 8 cycles okay 3 4 5 this is 7 and 8 okay and probably one more okay but before that let us understand that these are in my case trailing edge triggers okay trailing edge triggers represented by a bubble okay so this is trailing edge triggered flip flop trailing edge triggered so that you remember okay you can have any form that you want okay there is no restriction so in it in a trailing edge triggered what you are going to assume is your flip flops are initially flip flops are initially cleared okay all flip flops are initially cleared if you are using a leading edge triggered then you are going to assume that your flip flops are initially presetted presetted means they are initially one okay that's the only difference you can use any type of flip flop that you want trailing edge leading edge as you like okay so now let's see what is happening first we are going to draw the wave form